Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today it's time for a new favorite video. And I'm going to talk about my fave, fave? <laughs> five favorite lipsticks of 2019. And this has been hard, so freaking hard, but I think I have five here and this is only lipsticks that you can still buy. So these are no limited edition ones. I wanted to keep it like that because I have some lipsticks that is my like all time favorite, but they are no longer available and I don't want to like say to you the best lipstick ever and then it's not available. So these are five lipsticks that are available and I love them so, so much. It is four liquid lipsticks and one bullet lipsticks and it feels like I could have made like my 20 favorites of 2019. But I try to limit myself to only five and not five glosses, glosses, not five liquids and not five bullets. So these are five lipsticks that I really really love this year. So yeah, I'm going to start with the bullet lipstick. and. I don't, I never know where to put things. The bullet lipstick is from Linda Holberg. I talked about, I think it was my favorites of 2018. 18. I also talked about that Linda Holberg does one of my absolute favorite lipstick formulas. And the color I really love this year is Extra, which is not like even a color. This is just like a see-through shimmer lipstick. I use this so so much this summer. I don't even know if you can see it. It's here. It's a translucent base with shimmer in it or glitter specs and I love to use this this summer. I used it if I had makeup or if I didn't have makeup because this is SPF 15 and it's so comfortable and it gives something to the lips so this extra, it's something extra and it looks so good to put over something and I really really love it. I also love the famous shade but this extra I have used more than the famous one so this is absolutely amazing. And it feels pretty boring that this is one of my absolute favorite lips for this year but it is just... I love it so much. It is a wonderful, like, just it adds something extra. Okay, and then <laughs> one that I, I have talked about this before and it's like, I don't know why I like it. I do, but I don't. And it's the Colourpop Ultra Satin Lip in November. And this is like the only really pink lipstick I really love. I want to buy more of the Ultra Set and Lip and I think I will do it next year because these are amazing. And this I have used so much. It looks like this. This is pink but it's not too pink and it's not too dark and it's not too light. It's just, it is a perfect pink. I have loved it so much and it is, if I'm going with a pink lip, November I take 9 out of 10 times and the ultra satin lip they are so comfortable they are matte but not drying and anything so ultra satin is the best formula on Colourpop's liquid lipsticks and this November if you don't like pink but you want to wear pink sometime I can really recommend it because it's pink but it's not like in your face pink <laughs> I love that. Okay, so next up is this one from Body Shop. And this is the Matte Lip Liquid. This in, is in an aerobic Camellia. I got this in a calendar from Body Shop. And this is also a pink. It's pretty similar to November I see now. November is a little bit dark, I think. These are so similar. Is it why I love them both? I guess so. <laughs> so these, this is November and this is the one from Body Shop. These are pretty similar. So similar. This feels a little bit warmer. But I have used this so much. This I normally use if I have maybe some base on and I want to have something on my lips. But I don't want it to be 
super in your face. And then I use this and it is, if you have tried NYX Soft Matte, I think they are called, these feel the same way and it's not the most long lasting lipstick but it's so comfortable and this is one that you can really like, if it disappears you can just take more and it's not cakey, it's not drying, it's so so good to have on the lips. I really love the feel of it and I don't know why not more people talk about these because these are some of the best liquid lipsticks I know. Next up we have one that has been my favorite. I have, I got this a couple of months ago, one month ago maybe, and this one, this is going to be one of my absolute favorite lipsticks it is one of my absolute favorite lipsticks both in formula and in color and it is from kaleidos so yeah this made its way to the top only in a couple of weeks and this is immersion and first of all kaleidos this is the lip tonic they are like stains and the formula on these it's so watery and it's cooling and I just love it so much. It looks like this. It is pretty opaque on the lips, but you have to like go over it two times. But it's like the most comfortable and it stays on so good. It leaves like a stain on your lips when it goes away, so it doesn't disappear completely and I love that. And this formula is one of my absolute favorite formulas when it comes to liquid lipsticks. It's just, it feels great and I can have this with or without makeup, which I love <laughs> with lipsticks. So yeah, this lip tonic from Kaleidos, if you want to try any of the lip products, I would recommend these. Even if you don't like liquid lipsticks, I think you will love these because it's so freaking comfortable. So for the last one, and the one thing is that is missing from this is a red one and I this year has been the year where I went in, that I fell in love with red lipstick and I am thinking about doing my best red lipsticks for this year but I did a, my top five red lipsticks not that long ago so I don't want I don't know if that much have changed so I don't know, do you want to see more of red lips? It feels like I talk about red lipsticks a lot. But one of my absolute favorites is the one I have on and that is Unicorn Blood from Jeffree Star. I love this. This is dark, this is... It's amazing. I, I don't know what more to say. I have used this so so much this year. This is such an amazing color. First when I got this I was so afraid of this and I didn't use it for a super long while but then I started to use it and I was like this is so good. I swatched it here but you see it on my lips. I love this with red eyes, I love this with orange eyes, I love this with green eyes. I just love it and I think it suits me. The first time I put it on I was like I cannot go out like this. People will stare. But now I love it. And Jeffree Star has an amazing formula on lipsticks. Some of the be best liquid lipstick there is. And this Unicorn Blood, I, I just love it. I think it's not that much left, or maybe it is. It's so hard to see. Maybe not. I don't know. It's hard to see, but I have used this so much this year and I really, really love it. And it's one of my absolute go-to reds. And it's not this bright, as you can see, it's pretty deep, dark, it is just so, so good. If you want a dark, amazing red, buy Unicorn Blood and don't be afraid because it is so good. And yeah, that was my five favorite lipsticks of this year. I think it was so, so hard to pick. If you want to see anything more with red lipsticks, I can fix that, I think. Uh, I can leave all the other videos I have about red lipsticks up in the corner. I have done one swatching of all my red lipsticks. 
worst video I've ever done. My lips hurted like hell. I have also done my top five and I think I have done one more with lip red lipsticks. I'm not sure. So that was all for this video. These I am 99% sure has been my favorite lipsticks for this year. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!